Bonjour. This is a picture of what Paris might have looked like in the Middle Ages. It looks very different than the modern city Paris is today. Try and notice the differences for a moment. Long ago in medieval times, Paris was a small city on the River Seine that was surrounded by swamps and farmlands. You can see on the slide that people toiled and worked very hard on those farms and building the city of Paris to what it is today. I'd like you also to notice on the slide if you could spot the Cathedral of Notre Dame with this big round rose window in the center. Can you see the big circular window in the center? That is called a rose window. It's made out of beautiful stained glass panels held together with iron braces. The painted panels of stained glass are shaped like flower petals, hence the name Rose Window. Notre Dame has three beautiful rose windows in its cathedral. In medieval times, you were either royalty like a king or a queen, or you were a hard-working farmer, peasant, or a tradesperson. In 1163, the people of Paris, the peasants, the farmers, and the tradespeople, they volunteered for free to build the Cathedral of Notre Dame. If you can imagine, back at that time, there were no construction materials. There were no cranes. There were no construction trucks. And the people of Paris began to build the cathedral by hand. Farmers, tradespeople, and peasants joined together to dig 30-foot trenches in the swamp to stabilize the cathedral. Then they transported stones up the river Seine, carried them up through the swamp, hoisted them up over 200 feet to form what is now the bell towers on the front of the cathedral. This was such a massive effort because Notre Dame Cathedral is a cathedral large enough to hold 10,000 people. And in addition to being 200 feet high, it's 400 feet long. On the next slide, we're gonna look at how different life was for the kings and queens. Meet you on the next slide.